Okay, strap assisted low back stretch. Okay, this is a good one. You've got your strap, your single strap, just attached to your column, your post, whatever your fixed object is. We're going to use this to help push our uh, hips back and start stretching that low back. So both hands through the strap or holding on to it, whatever you've got. And go ahead and feet shoulder width apart. I'm just going to push my hips back. And as I do that, I'm going to let my arms reach forward. And as you can see, my, my back's starting to, to stretch down. And once you get in this bottom position, just try to hold that. So I'm getting a really good stretch in my low back right in that position. So again, just hold that for the six to eight second count. Bring yourself back up, take tension off, and we'll lower back in it. So by just pushing the hips back and keeping the arms straight, you're really going to stretch that low back. If we want to stretch the hips, we can do the same thing. Bring your hands through crossways, and now take yourself down more on the, into a squat position, and just try to see if you can sink down into a deep squat hold, and just try to hold this position. So there's a lot more stretch now in the hips which we have to work on uh, stretching and mobility, both within the back and the hips. So this is more hips, holding on to this, okay? So the key with that strap is I can pull myself back out. I'm not going to get stuck. So here's my hip stretch sinking down, my back stretch, my arms are straight, and my hips go back. So both of these variations will be very, very effective. Hip stretch and low back stretch, which is strap.